recording? Yep. So we got this restaurant in. Unfortunately, we can't, we got no room to blend. So we're gonna have to get this cellar near perfection. I've started a spray out car there. I'm gonna just get the ball rolling here on the bumper. Gonna have to cover the whole bumper basically. But I'm gonna try to stay away from here and just test a little bit of color like this. Bring a 22 PSI. Gonna try to keep it real small there. When you're dealing with white pearls, you want to make sure that you're putting enough of the ground coat on and you're putting it on evenly. So that way the pearl won't have to do anything special to be able to look good. You want to have a uniform bed for the mid coat to lay down nicely on it. This is looking okay. That's all that's getting. I can see the color blending out all right. Most of the time you can do that. I got my uh, let's put that there. Man, I've been so busy lately. It's just crazy. But it's good. It's good. I'm happy. I'm very happy. We're gonna flash this off, flash that off, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna put, put one coat of pearl on the spray out card. Let's see if it's flashed off yet. No, it's still wet a little bit. Another thing you want to make sure when you're doing a white pearl, and uh, this is something that you most of you probably know, but uh, I find that when you let the, the, are we still recording? I hope so. Yeah. When you let the, uh, the ground coat flash off really well, you're able to lay that down on here smoother uh, because it's not going to melt together. I don't know if that makes sense. But you don't want 
the 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 ground coat and the mid coat to melt together. You wanna get that? Put it here. Twenty-five. Gonna put one even coat, just like an even coat. Just, just even. How that dries. I did two different guns, so then I could be ahead. I could be ahead of the car while I'm spraying it, right? So the car has brown coat on. The the spray car has pearl coat. Try to not put it on too heavy on there. Just a little bit. Put another coat. Same pressure. Same kind of coat. Just an even coat. off right and then now we'll have one coat and two coats and then what I'll do is sew our control coat over both of them and we'll see how it looks all right check it out two coats two coats looks good with the light without the light Two coats looks good. I haven't put a control coat coat yet, but I will. It looks great. I really, I'm really happy with that. Awesome. So, see now I'm ahead of the game because that is ready for pearl. That's ready for pearl, right? And then what I'll do is I'll put a control coat on this, and then. Uh, check it to make sure it's good but so far so good very happy with it I'm gonna tack it I'm gonna blow it and I'm going to uh, neutralize it spraying at the same pressure that you sprayed the spray car. There we go. Spray looks good. And even coat. Nice and even. Not too heavy. Not too dry. Just right. Same thing here. Got to go fairly slow here. I want to see what I'm doing. Always look at what the gun is doing. Never look at the gun itself. The gun itself is not important. Always look at what the gun is doing. You have to make sure you look at what the gun is doing.
hard to see sometimes. So, but if you stay consistent, as soon as you get a light, like over here, then you know how much you're putting on down here, because you're going at the same speed, same distance. And that's what you want. You want to stay consistent. And that's how you're able to achieve consistent paint jobs. You want to give that a flash? Then we'll put on our second coat exactly the same way. Okay, are we recording? Yeah, I'm paranoid now. I want to always check. You can show where it's the same. Keep it consistent, baby. Consistent, consistent, consistent. I'm joining me here on Motivated Painters and you're not freaked out because I'm like pumped up all the time I'm sorry, I, but I know I'm not sorry, I'm not going to apologize for uh, who I am and uh, I love it so anyways, we're going to do a little control code 18 PSI, boom just like that just a little mist over to smoothing things out over here make sure there's no Rough patches. Whoops. There we go. Awesome. And then, loving that. We're gonna put another coat, uh, control coat. So there's our first coat, second coat, and now control coat. Awesome. This color is really good. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised. I was kind of bracing for the worst, but it turns out to be really good. So this, I let this flash off for so long. I did two jobs before I finished this one. I did the black, uh, the gray jag, and I did the black uh, three series that's baking now. Now I'm going to mix up some clear, and uh, we're good to go on this. Okay, we are ready for clear. Here we go.
awesome. Looking good so far. Give that a couple minutes. So I've been using a different mix of uh, PPG clear. I've been using 80% 520 and 20% 550. It's been working out really well and I'm really liking it. And you know, just a few minutes between coats, put another coat, and then I go and I bake it at uh, 150 for 20 minutes. And it's been working really, really, really well. Make sure she's working? Yeah. I always do this. Always. Good. Good boys and girls, looks very good. I'm very happy with it. Nice and smooth. We kick it into bake, and we're ready to go. Ready to move on to the next vehicle. All right, I love you. I hope you uh, have an amazing day, week, uh, whatever it is, whatever time you are looking at this. Oh, there goes the spare card. But you gotta put some clear on. How come uh, spiral cards never land upright? They always land with the painted part down. No idea. Okay, let's put some clear on.
right. And I guess we can check it here. And that color is on point. I love it. I love it when a color just looks right. Oh, I wish this would happen more often. But uh, that looks beautiful. I love it. See the one coat? It looks too creamy. I don't know how it looks in the camera. But it looks too creamy in here. And that one just looks right. Love it. So now we got, you know, um, now we got a great, great uh, spray card for this color. If I ever do it again. We don't get many Maseratis, but anyhow, I love you. I love you so much. God bless you. Take care.